Hi friends! Welcome back to another video and for today's video, I will be finally showing y'all how I edit my Instagram photos. Yay! So this video is actually highly, highly requested over on my Instagram and I really don't know why because I literally have like the most easiest and like basic editing. But before we start doing like the tutorial I guess I'm just gonna show y'all how my Instagram looks like so that you'll get like the idea of like the theme I guess that I'm going for by the way if you haven't followed me on Instagram yet my username is at chiniverse so yeah as I said my feed is like very basic and very plain and I only use like one app to edit so yeah so the main app that I use to edit my photos is actually called Foodie and I think this app is actually very popular because I know a lot of people actually uses this app so I'm just gonna quickly choose a photo to edit and oh my god I'm so sorry like my gallery is like an actual mess but here I'm just choosing out a photo that I took a while ago so Foodie actually has a lot of filters to choose from and they're like really 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 good. Another feature on Foodie that I really appreciate is that you can actually save your edits so that you could use the same settings over and over again for like future photos and stuff. So I'm just adjusting the strength here and like since this is a tutorial I will be showing you like an in-depth process of what my editing looks like and stuff so i'm just gonna play like a speed through video over here and then i'll be putting the recipes over on the side because it does vary depending on the photo so yeah So after you edit, you're just gonna click on save and then you're done. That's basically it and like that's how easy like my editing takes. So a bonus app that I use is called Preview. So basically over here on Preview, you could actually plan out what your feed would look like and stuff. And it's actually very very easy to use. You're just gonna go ahead and click on the plus sign and then after that you're just gonna add the photo that you want to post and then like the good thing about like this app is that you could move your photos around so that you know the best spot they could be in and stuff and like this is I guess like the secret to having a cohesive feed so yeah this is how the final photo turned out and as I said, I really have like the easiest editing. So I hope y'all enjoyed this video. That's it for the video, I guess. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see y'all in my next videos. So yeah, bye friends!